Merry Christmas, I hope you had a good one and welcome to today's video. So I'm going to do a bit more of a vlog slash review. I went to Hadley Park in Benfleet, Essex for the first time and I thought it would be cool to show you what it was like and to have a little bit more of a discussion about the trip. So I had various friends who'd been there before, I wasn't invited <laughs> and they all said the climbs are absolutely brutal now if you know me you know I don't like climbing so why did I go to Hadley Park I'm not sure myself but I went there and I thought to myself let's see how this goes it's not far from me and there aren't many popular places to go on the East Coast so I thought let's try it It took me just under an hour to get there and the car park was mostly empty, which was nice. Um, I did get a little lost once I left the car, but to be fair, there are a few signs um, and maps scattered around, but I didn't find them very clear. So if you do get there um, and you're at the start of the trails, just take the first left and then take a right and you'll be in front of the first of many climbs you have a red option which is incredibly steep and quite difficult to do if you don't have enough momentum then you have the blue option which is less steep but longer so it's up to you which you decide to do but I did both because I thought I went the wrong way so I went back down and then I had to go back up again Let me tell you something as well, is there a sea breeze or what? At some point I thought I was going to fly away. I couldn't even hear myself think. There was also ocean spray. I'm, I'm sure that's what it is because it wasn't raining on that day. Um, and riding Hadley Park truly felt like doing a triathlon. You get wet, you ride your bike, and then you also have the running aspect because you're running away from all the cows and also climbing up hills because your legs just can't take it. Oh my god, here I nearly had a heart attack. I nearly jumped off the bike and told the cows to keep the bike. What the heck? No one told me there would be free range cows all over the place and cow poo. Boy, I was thinking, all right, this seems to be ramping up a bit. There was the first drop and I was thinking, what next? Yeah, that's right. How do you like <laughs> some cows? So beware of that if you ever go. Quite pretty, Quite pretty. Luckily, none of the cows were blocking my paths at all, but you might just bump into one when you least expect it. I didn't do that jump part just because I wasn't feeling it. I was exhausted and shattered after the first section, but I will definitely go back to Hadley Park just because it was a really good workout and I will try all the features on that visit. Some sections are really nice. Um, you can build a bit of speed and then there are um, some really nice winding corners, which for someone like me who is terrible with corners, it's quite good practice. Also there was a pumping um, section which switched things up a bit as it was getting a bit monotonous. Like the 
I didn't watch much of the Olympic Games when it happened at the time, but because I knew I was going to Hadley, I checked out some YouTube videos and I watched the MTV race. Um, and I wanted to see what it was like. There was definitely a lot of GoPro effect going on. The TV makes it look much flatter than it actually is and it's far from flat. Obviously after you do a really steep climb you do expect there to be a nice downhill um, section and there are some at Hadley but I find most don't pay off. There seems to be a lot more climbing than anything else and the steep descents which are the black trousers you'll see on the Olympics are really steep. I mean, most people stuck to the red trails and even they were stupidly steep. Um, there were loads of rock gardens. If you want to get good at rock gardens, then Hadley Park is the place to go. Um, there was one or two rock garden descents that I just didn't even bother with. Do you know, I didn't feel like breaking my jaw or <laughs> falling on my face onto a sharp rock so I skipped those um, but here's a quick look at some of the rock gardens sections that you'll find I mean they are um, scattered around the place and some are really ridiculous but I didn't go down those so it's up to you whether you want to go down them slowly or just you know go really fast um, but Hadley Park is certainly a workout Hadley Park is very cross country so if you're, if you're not into um, cross country you won't like it there but if you have an e-bike you'll, you'll love it you know it's great for e-bikes. Once again thank you for watching my video I really hope that you liked it and thank you again guys for your support I really appreciate it. So if you liked the video please leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and feel free to add me on Instagram at Ride with Sean.